I think it's a special movie already from the uh, thriller, and we are expecting to see the full movie this time. Yeah, so, and my expectation is that it's going to be wow. Uh, I'm really, really excited. You can see the expression on my face, and I can't wait to get in there and watch it. All right, Mac, you're welcome to the Oratory movie premiere. Thank you. All right, so what's your expectation from the movie you're about to watch right now? Well, you can see it's sold out. Tickets are sold out. It's a fantastic movie. I saw the premiere in London, and um, it's a blast. What did I learn? I learned a lot. Oh, great. I learned a lot. I love Bosco Boys. I love the Don Bosco story. I love Mama Margaret's story. <laughs> and watching this movie made a lot of things come alive in my mind, made it real and vivid. So I learned to, that it's really important to help to believe in your dreams and go for your dreams irrespective of the challenges, irrespective of what people say. Just trust in God and go for it. All right, so you're going to tell us, did you enjoy the movie? Was it fun? Were you inspired in any way? Yes, I enjoyed the movie. It was, it was interesting. Yes, it was, it was inspiring. It, 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 it taught me how to help people all over the world. The movie was incredible. It was, uh, I don't have anything to say about it, but the movie really inspired me to help those in need, my fellow colleagues, and I really tell my friends about the movie and they should watch it. Okay, my name is Reverend Father Paul Arioli, the Archbishop Secretary of the Archdiocese of Lagos. That's really wonderful, Padre. So, Father, I believe you saw the movie, The Oratory. So, was it, what was your comments? Was it fun? Was it inspiring? Was it interesting to you? It was everything in one. Fantastic. It's a masterpiece being put together. Yes, it was everything and even much more. Um, first of all, I've always known the director Obi Emeloye to be a prolific filmmaker, so I was expecting nothing less of the standard in quality. Two, so it was good to see movies that inculcate good values and preach, you know, spirituality, and these are some of the morals and things I stand for. So all around, I'm very impressed. So um, I think that taking it from here, I, mean, I think it's just a message. Yeah, it calls for action, so it's not just to watch and get entertained and be working. So it would be good to know what next. Thank you for for staying for an hour and a half. Time flies when you're having fun. Um, to to enjoy the story that Father Cyril Odia gave birth to, and and gave the baby to me to raise, and I with the, my team made a film without a budget, but we made a film that we are very proud of. Sir, I believe you are feeling great today, are you? Very, very happy. It's a dream come true and this is just the beginning. We've been waiting for this for so long and it's absolutely unacceptable to have so many thousands of young people roaming our streets, children completely and utterly abandoned and people have been talking and we just feel this is a way to raise this awareness uh, for what Salesians in Nigeria really want to do and I'm happy today that we are starting in this way. It's just the beginning as I said and I'm really, really excited to be here. John Castle!